Hello there, morons. It is Victor, the king of the morons, here with an update on the um, daddy-mommy situation. As uh, those of you who have been following the story know, my wife uh, had to go in the hospital Friday night because of high blood pressure. I don't know if I, I don't know how much I told you in the last video. I was so tired. I'm so tired now, but I've taken a bath. <sighs> ah, smells like a good, clean t-shirt, actually. This is the first time I'm wearing my new Born Army t-shirt. By the way, I don't know if you can tell, but if you get really close, you can't really, it's hard to tell. What if I turn off the light here? Can you guys see that this actually has um, smiley faces? Can you see that? It's actually smiley faces there. That's pretty cool, huh? Yes. Anyway, it's a pretty cool shirt. Uh, okay, this is this video is just an update of what, what happened for me, not just for you guys, but for me so I can remember someday, this uh, day would happen because this is becoming a kind of a, a bit of an adventure. So, she was, um, she had a um, high blood pressure and the doctor said, it's dangerous. So they wanted, she went in for a checkup only, right, on Friday morning. She emailed me from school and she's like, oh, I got to stay. And um, the next morning, uh, oh, she spent the night there and the next, and I stayed up like an idiot all night, you know, just screwing around on the internet and taking care of business. I have things to do. And then she, um, the next, I, I think that was right. Oh, that was that Friday morning, right? No, that was Thursday morning. Yeah, it was Thursday morning. So Friday morning, I got up and I went to work. And I got a text on my trusty iPhone. that said, come as soon as you can. Uh, they're, and they're moving. Go home and get the car and come get me. And complicated. But anyway, they moved her. They put her in an ambulance and took her to a bigger hospital. Because her blood pressure was getting worse. The high blood pressure was getting worse. And um, the, the, the quaint little hospital where she wanted to have a baby was... Um, they, they couldn't do it there. She was at a small place in Oskanen, uh, near near there. Not actually there, in Oskanen, but... Anyway, so I went and got the car, went, uh, met, met her at the... I went to the wrong... Oh, so this is funny. It's stupid funny. I'm I'm rushing home, and I'm rushing so quick, somehow I get turned around, I jump on the, on the opposite side of the platform, and I go in the wrong direction, and I'm, like, texting my parents on Facebook, telling them what's happening, you know? And I don't realize until three stops later that I'm in the wrong, going the wrong direction. I'm like, fuck. So I jump off, go upstairs, go across, go down again, go, go back on the platform, get on the right, right train, go in the right direction, get home, get in the car, um, go to the wrong hospital. <laughs> because there's two hospitals near our house. I knew, I knew it was near our house. For some reason, I thought it was the same place where I had my operation in the summer. I go there, I go to the counter. I'm like, I'm looking for, you know, blah, blah, blah. And like... Uh, we don't know who you're, who you're talking about, right? No idea. And I'm like, this is uh, blah, 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 hospital, right? And they're like, no, <laughs> that's over there. So it's like 17 minutes away. I'm like, ah. Then I, I, go to the, I go to the parking and I'm out of money. I'm like, oh my God, I forgot I put, I have a mana card. And I think I talked about this. The mana card, you can you can like put 10,000 yen on this. And I did. And I'm like, oh, there's a hundred dollars. And I thought, I only have a thousand yen left. So on the way to... um. On the way to the other hospital, I stopped by the liquor store where we often go. We used to go. You've seen, and if you watch my videos, you've seen, I always stop by a liquor store and talk to people and my friends there. And I'm like, can I borrow a thousand yen? Because I, I forgot I don't have any money. And I, I just want to go, you know, uh, I want to go to uh, the hospital and I need to pay for parking. I don't need money for anything else. I know my wife's got money there probably, right? Well, yeah. Yeah, I know she does. Um, she put 50,000 yen, which is about, I don't know, not actually not that much, $400 in an envelope. You know, take care, take care of a little whatever duties it's not that expensive for daily stuff because you know we didn't expect it would be any complication you pay a little this a little that anyways though i get to the hospital see her she's she's like in she's in a good mood she goes i was in the ambulance it was so fun it was cool i'm like she was i should have taken a video <laughs> like yeah did you take a video she goes no i couldn't take a video i felt guilty because i feel fine so she actually feels fine but her Blood pressure, blood pressure. I haven't had any of this. I'm, I'm waiting to down this. I haven't had any liquor today. Liquor in the front. Um, liquor right here in the front. Okay. Anyway, I um, woo, I didn't. Um, she didn't take the video, and she felt guilty because she's she was feeling fine. But the doctor says it's apparently um, bad. So she's there. If, yeah. Oh yeah. The reason they moved her was because her blood pressure got higher, which is really bad. So then I, you know, I, I uh, talked to her for a little while and then I rushed back to the old hospital and paid the bill, which was 22,000 yen. Not bad. That's about 
$200. Came back to the new hospital. Then I had to hear a speech from the doctor. Actually, I get the speech first. And then I went to the new hospital. The speech of the doctor goes all through all the possibilities. Okay, we might have to, if the blood pressure keeps high, we will have to uh, perform an emergency, um, an emergency uh, C-section, cesarean section. And, and if... Um, it, but we prefer to wait until Monday because uh, we have more staff on Monday on the weekend. You know, we don't have so much staff. And it's kind of funny. Like, I was talking to Molly about this on Warmoth Shot Channel. He's like, yeah, yeah, people can't have babies on the weekend because everyone's busy, you know, have, having their days off. So it's kind of funny. Um, yeah, so that's what was happening. Then I went to the old hospital, paid off the bill. Then I had to go to school. Take care, take care of a class that we, have time, we didn't have time to cancel because the students are coming from, like, a lot of my students come from out of town because... I'm such a good teacher. No, seriously, they, they'll, they'll like travel 45 minutes or so for my class. So um, anyway, took care of the class, then went back to see her and hung. And I was so exhausted. I was like, I'm just going to sit in this chair. And they had this awful fold up chair that was kind of, you know, sometimes sh chairs lose their kind of straightness and it's like sloping down. And I'm like, just sitting there kind of like, this is so uncomfortable, uh, <laughs> trying to sleep. And they got her in the closest room next to the nurse station because her situation is the worst, right? She's the most, I guess, in, in danger. She's the most in danger. What, what's the word you would use? She's the most. She's a high. She has. She's the most at risk patient at this at the moment. So, and she's like, I can't sleep at all. Like people just keep moving around and they're noisy. So we hang out a little bit, make jokes and blah blah, and have fun. The food comes, and and then. Um, then I have to leave and go back to school and teach um, teach another class. Uh, actually, that morning it was look. This is morning. Go to the hospital. Go to no. Go to work. Go to school. Go to the hospital. Go back to school. Go back to the hospital. Go back to school. Go home. Oh no, sorry. I, and one of the and I go back. Go back to the hospital. Go home. Go to school. Go home. That, that was it. Now I'm home. I take a shower. Yes, that was that was that was back. Uh, actually, the. Uh, not the highlight of, well, the highlight, the highlight of my day. It felt good to take a shower. We can't say it's a highlight of my day. Of highlight of my day is my wife is still, is good. She's doing well. Oh, well, you know, and she hasn't had the baby yet, which is kind of good, I guess. Um, so I would like to announce, uh, I know I'm getting around to this. Uh, I'd like to announce the uh, contest, kind of contest. Just a friendly contest, just a giveaway. Just a, you know, thank you for listening kind of crap. Um, and teach you a little Japanese. So you're going to have to, this is my video, so you're going to have to sit through the Japanese, right? Um, Ninshin shiteiru, pregnant. Kanojo ninshin shiteiru, she's pregnant, right? And a pregnant woman is called ninpu, or, but we often pregnant. And we often, so ninshin shiteiru is pregnant. But uh, if a woman is pregnant, we say ninpu or ninpu san, the um, on, honorable son at the end of the word, ninpu san. Nin, ninpu, ninpu san. <laughs> Kind of funny, huh? Ninpu. Um, we're hoping for, we were hoping for a Shizen Boomben, which is a natural birth. Shizen is natural. Boomben, I've never seen before, but I gotta assume it means birth, though. I wouldn't know that just by looking at that kanji at all. Uh, the second half, yeah, but the first, but it's rare. We we're hoping for a shin, shin, Shizen Boomben because, because um, if you get a Teo, oh, that's wrong, kan, is that right? Yeah, Teo Sekai is a cesarean section. I believe that's right. Yeah, it looks funny to me now. Uh, cesarean section or a C-section. Uh, apparently, you know, it cuts through, apparently, apparently I've never been on live TV, apparently it cuts through the stomach and it's it takes like years before you feel normal again. Um, but at least, at least the uh, the vagina is not destroyed. So, <laughs> sorry, I had to make that joke. Um, no, actually, you know what? I was thinking about the girl. The girl that was the in the cheerleader in Heroes. Apparently, I didn't. I didn't see the. Uh, the. I didn't really, really read the article because I try my best not to read stupid articles. But the headline on Yahoo was like, uh, "Having ninety nine, her husband. I don't know her husband's name, but having his baby destroyed my body." And of course, I was thinking, you know, what part? <laughs> you know, of course, you know, you know, what I'm thinking, right? So, um, and she's married to, I guess, a huge guy. Like in the picture, she's small and he's, maybe she's really small and he's huge. I don't know. Anyway, uh, another word that I thought was interesting to teach you is hasui, because ha means break or tear or rip. And sui is water. Hasui. Mizu is water, but in this case, you pronounce it hasui. Sui. Hasui, water breaking. So, hasui shita would be uh, her water broke. Ninshin chudoku sho is toxemia of pregnancy, and that's what's happening to her. Her body is, 
I don't. I really don't understand. But the the blood pressure is really bad, and she can't retain protein. Tampaku, I believe that's what they said. Though I don't. I, I believe they meant this, right? Is that it? I believe that's what they mean. Um, which is protein, but um, not sure. Not sure about that. Anyway, I believe that's it. Check it. Check it. If just look up protein and see if that's if that kanji matches. If not, just tell me. I'm, this is not a formal lesson. But let me announce. Um, oh yeah, so they they got to check her pee because it, uh, the protein comes out in the pee. So if the if the if you lose too much protein, the baby. Uh, I I don't know exactly. I guess the baby can hurt. Someone tell me you can get a like a like in the comments that you can get a stroke from uh, from um, you know not um, from the pee. Uh, no, I'm sorry, not. Focus, Victor. You get a stroke from high blood pressure. So who knows? Okay, the contest is very simple. Okay, all we, we already know. You have a really, really good uh, chance of guessing the date, the time. Uh, it's going to happen in the, probably in the next two or three days. Um, but we don't know. It could happen tomorrow. Could it happen Sunday morning? Could it happen fr um, Sunday night, Saturday night, Monday, Monday night, Tuesday? We don't know. So you have to guess the date. You have to guess the time. You have to guess the sex, because I still don't know the sex. Only my wife knows. If you know my wife, then you're disqualified from the sex one, um, if you know the answer. You have to guess guess the weight and the length, because I believe they have a they, they measure it, like the length. And I'm not talking about the pee-pee. I'm talking about the baby's body, okay? Um, you have to measure the length. You have to guess the length. So we have weight, length time of birth, date of birth, and sex. So five things. So of course, you know, I doubt anyone's going to get all five, but um, you know, well, I'll just pick the person who's closest. closest. And what do you get? That's, that's not just a, a token of my appreciation. You get a t-shirt. Yes, a t-shirt, right? And uh, if you don't want a t-shirt, um, well, too bad. Give it to somebody. <laughs> or order want to give it to someone. Um, but we have a big selection of t-shirts and mugs as well, right? We have some mugs. The mugs are double-sided, by the way, which is cool. If you look at the mug, I think the mugs are really cool because I got myself mugs coming soon. The mug, check this out. Yeah, I'll, I'll throw in a mug too. I mean, uh, as a choice, see? The mug can also have, see? More on army on, I don't know if you guys can see that, but more on army on one side, right? Boom, 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 woo, right? Or it can have live large on one side. So it's a double-sided mug, right? So that's pretty cool, don't you think? Or maybe just me. Anyway, there's a lot of choices, t-shirts you can have. So it's just for fun. Anyway, that's the mini contest. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Thanks for thumbing up uh, the videos because, you know, um, they seem to, it, seem, it really helps. It really helps when you thumb up the videos immediately after this, after the video comes up comes out just thumb it up really helps i guess that's about it to you know more things coming um your way i have lots of videos that i feel weird to put out right now so i'm just making this video i have a lot of other videos that are coming out that are more i have gopro videos tons of gopro videos with the new gopro what the hell is new gopro camera the new gopro camera i'm still fiddling with the gaming videos i still i guess i should open up a new channel but i don't know you know i'm, I'm lazy I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm not lazy. But I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for all the good wishes. I really appreciate it. Follow me on Twitter and on Facebook, by the way. The links are in the description. And Instagram for more information. I'm, I, I posted some updates on Twitter today as it was happening. And on Instagram as well. So you can follow me and keep up to date uh, that way as well. And boy, don't I love the sound of my own voice. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.